Me, 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 me. How do the British people say, uh, you, you have to show it in a winning night in Stoke? <laughs> uh, team of the Year Buller, where's Team of the Year Buller? Can you vote for him? Buller! I'm Buller's the net! What if Thomas Buller had a Team of the Year? What if Thomas Buller had a Team of the Year? Thomas Buller deserves skill moves. Still got it! Me, 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 me. Let's go! Good evening, everyone. I'm going to keep it about the fullest stack that I could possibly can with you boys. I don't even know how to start this video. I'm just sitting here. I think I'm still dreaming. Whoever at EA came up with the idea of putting this card in as an FPC. One, thank you for the four-star skill moves. Two, could it have been 94 rated? I'm just saying. All right, let's go. Bullsucking boys and welcome to the 89 player moments Thomas Muller players review episodia showcasing that time or honoring that time in FIFA it was a 2012-2013 scored that 123rd minute goal in that infamous DFO, uh, DFB Pokal match uh, and today gets himself a long awaited much anticipated and fully deserved player moments card he's about 280,000 coins depending on the console so he's not cheap by any measure uh, but he does get himself some pretty nice upgrades namely that 4 star skill move upgrade really really happy to see that um and then also get some really nice uh really nice stats that are fully jacked off about 116 total in game stat upgrade over his 88 in form you don't do a player's way view on Thomas Muller without having Lufin Golski you don't do a player's way view without doing uh Serge Gnabry uh Tony Kous Sami Khedira am I listing wait there's some someone's missing who's missing Shit. Smash like on the video for an 89 moments Thomas Muller. Smash like on the video for reuniting him with Robin and Ribery. Reuniting the Bayern boys and living our absolute best life in February 2021. If you guys are new to the channel, hit that subscribe button down below. And like I always say, boys, let's just dive right into it. So you get the four-star skill move upgrade, which is great from the three-star uh, from the three-star skill moves. Four-star uh, four-star weak foot. He always had it. We dive into the stats. He's got the dual 85s, which with the Hunter Kemp style goes up to 95-95. That's going to be something we pay particularly close attention to. Does he feel like uh, he's got jacked off uh, stats? Uh, does he feel like he have 95 acceleration, 95 sprint speed? Attacking positioning is arguably the most accurate stat on Thomas Muller that I've seen from any specific stat that has been tinkered with with a player moments, right? With the player moments card and some of the other cards, the EA are now able to go in and um, make those particular stats uh, jacked off. So the attacking positioning, 99, incredible. 99 finishing with 95 composure. I'm not expecting him to miss anything. He's got the outside the foot shot trait. Shot power's a little bit sus, so with that, we're we're gonna get it up to uh we're gonna get it up to 88 volleys goes up to 99 passing stats are pretty damn decent looks like you could maybe even play a center forward role bro uh, 90 vision with 90 crossing 89 short passing with 83 long passing with the 86 uh with the 86 curve he's got the 86 agility which leads me to think maybe maybe engine might be the thing to do to get his agility over 90 but because his ball control is 92 and because his dribbling's already 85 i feel like we don't really need to touch that too much 89 stamina is really great and then 83 strength is maybe one of the key factors that separates this card um and, and gives him a little bit of a uh, value and might be the thing that pushes you over the edge to complete this spc now if you're a Bayern supporter of course you're going to go ahead and you're going to get this spc done um solid player leadership outside the foot shot um and uh that's i mean not really too much else to say we've got luvin golski that's right luvin golski get it because goals i'm out we've got ourselves kadia we got ourselves Cruz, a couple of members of the a couple other members of the 2014 world cup german national team and uh we're gonna bring on rippery and robin right off the jump um wasn't able to figure out a way to get it on uh on on full chem without bringing them on as subs but i'm not too fussed about it we're gonna run the 442 we're gonna run luvin golski and thomas muller as striker pairings left striker and then right striker respectively i know there's a bunch of you guys uh that are thinking to yourselves uh, it, it, do i need to be doing this thomas miller spc now that we have the likes of a you know um a thorgan hazard card who's out there uh we just have this luka jovic card who yes will be getting his own episodia um is uh is thomas miller still worth completing in this uh what if landscape so let's get into match number one let's not delay things any further let's see how this thomas muller plays up top next to his next to his Bayern teammate seems like they've been playing for 20 years together luvin golski match number one Los Gates. Oh, and Torsten Frings is the manager. Can't can't forget Torsten Frings is our cheeky manager. Some of y'all guys don't even know about Torsten Frings. I feel like I'm I feel like I'm here to educate. Your barber. Alright, the first thing that we like to do. Listen to me, my 
abgehalten. Wir sind wieder da und wir zerstören die Lüge. I don't think I've ever been as nervous on a breakaway goal as I was right there. Finishing, we, we expect that. 99 attack positioning, 99 finishing with 95 composure. We expected Thomas Muller to make that. We expect him not to miss anything. Okay, on the ball. How's he feel? Body faint. You can do that. Come at me, bro. Let's go, come on. Wait. Let's... Let's see what he feels like on the ball. Yeah, body faint one, body faint two, body faint three. Ah, come on, bro. That's why, that's why I made no noise, best keeper in the game. Yeah, he's got his little custom, he's got his little custom Thomas Muller legs. They move pretty nice. Does he feel super silky on the ball? No. Thomas Muller. Now we're 95 sprint speed, 95 acceleration. Come on, bro. Thomas Muller, right place at the right time. And that's maybe the most Thomas Muller goal that we could have scored, showcasing the attack and positioning. Is that the attack and positioning? I don't know. Should he be 92, 93 rated? Yeah. Is he going to get that maybe once team of the season comes around? Here, here's what I'll say. I'm, I'm happy to use this 89 Thomas Muller card, get it done with a little bit of fodder, and then use it till, um, use it till he gets his team of the season card. Skills now. Hey, I'm gonna keep it stacked. Good goal. He literally sent my entire team to the shop. Let's go, Thomas Muller. Bangs it in, and he's up to his hatty, boys. I'm not expecting Thomas Muller to feel like a uh, Pele. You know, am I happy that he has the four star skill moves? Absolutely. Um,. That's probably what jacked off his stats. You know, that's probably what jacked off his price to about 50, you know, 50k. I mean, like, without it, I feel like it's a 180, 200,000, uh, you know, probably maybe even a 150, you know. But the, he's got pace now, boys. Just him. He just slots him in like it's nothing. That's Nicholas Pope. That's the best keeper in the game. This, literally, Thomas Muller has put four past this guy called Your Barber, and he's just rage quit, and he's got Nicholas Pope. If that is not, a, if, if, that, if that's not enough footage or whatnot that you need to see from the card to understand that there's something different about this Thomas Muller card. You know what? Maybe this, maybe Thomas Muller had it in him all along. He just needed a little bit of agility. He, he needed just a little bit of pace. Thomas Muller coming with a four goal performance. Things you absolutely love to see. Hey, speaking about, uh, speaking about Dynamo Zagreb, don't look now, but Mi, uh, Mislav Orsic, he's got himself a man of the match, uh, he's got himself a man of the match card that goes for 50k with 96 pace. Muller. He does it all. He's not a selfish player. He does it all. He likes providing. He's a giver. I have never seen a more embarrassing display in my entire career. Okay. I, you know, yeah, you know what? I didn't I didn't I didn't want to win this game anyway. I didn't want to win the game anyway, bro. Don't air the, you won't air this, right? <laughs> Moves called? It's called the it's called the Burba. It's called the body faint. No, he did not just. Thomas Muller now, dude. What's the pace like? Is it 95-95? Oh my! Thomas, was ist los mit dir, Junge? Wie hast du das gemacht? Ah, das ist aber Wahnsinn, Junge. Was ist das für eine Karte? Thomas Muller, ich... Junge, was machst du, Junge? World Cup Goal? I think we need to call him Mullardino. I think he needs... I think we'd... He does the squiggle move really nicely. 
He does the wiggle move very, very nicely. I gotta say, of all the skill moves, the, the wiggle is probably the one that he can do the best. This guy's put down his controller. He probably... I don't think he can handle anymore, dude. Leeds just lost 1-0 to Sheffield United. I thought Leeds were meant to be banging goals. Don't let anyone tell you that this Thomas Muller card is not... <laughs> this Thomas Muller card has some moves, boys. The lad has moves. All right, boys. There you have it, Thomas Muller. I think he's gonna go in and he's gonna collect his. He's gonna collect his man of the match, Thomas freaking Muller. Very much like that Tifo, the werewolf Tifo has turned into a beast of sorts. I kind of like, how about that for po how about that for a little bit of poetry? Look, he's got the diarrhea on his legs. He doesn't even care, dude. This guy is, is, is interessiert mich nicht. Goes ahead and gets himself four goals. Dribbles completed 23 out of 32 and just absolutely bangs in some goals. 14 shots, 10 on target. I mean, we just actually, we actually ran circles around this guy, you know? This was, this was hella impressive right here. Look how he just kind of gets through two defenders. You ever just look at the stadium and how crazy it is? Again, 270,000, 280,000 coins is not cheap. Uh, we're going to give it a value rating. Um, here's the thing. There's a lot of really solid options in the Bundesliga. You know, for, uh, other four-star, four-star guys with a lot more agility. Um, sure, maybe they don't have the finishing. Maybe they don't, they don't have the composure. They don't have some of the other stats that Thomas Buller has. But I'm talking about, you know, the Serge Gnabry, if you did that SBC. The Thorgan Hazard card that's tradable. The, the Luka Jovic, for example, that's four-star four, uh, four -star skill moves. Four-star skill moves now and five-star weak foot. Um, so given the options that we have in the Bundesliga, uh, I, I I can't, I, I don't feel co uh, confident giving this a high uh, value rating. So I am going to go ahead and I'm going to give it a three out of five. For me, as emotionally connected as I am to this card, I just still can't in my right mind um, recommend him in terms of a four out of five. But uh, Manuel Neuer. We just packed a tradable Manuel Neuer from the Prime, from the Prime Electrum Players Pack from the Thomas Muller SBC. Now, on the pitch performance, I gotta say, with the Hunter, again, I reviewed him, I uh, did the player's way view with him, uh, with the Hunter on, four to five in terms of on the pitch performance was really, really good for us. Uh, felt really, really yamboyish. But the most important thing about this Thomas Muller card, you get him in the box and there's no fear about missing. And that's the most important thing. Uh, maybe you pay a premium for that, but you get him inside the box, you don't have this, you don't, there's no worry that you're gonna miss the chance. Most of, more often than not, he's gonna bang it in. But uh, that's gonna do it for the episode here, boys. Now, is it a thumbs up? Uh, I, of course, I'm gonna give it a thumbs up. Am I gonna recommend that everyone and their mothers go out and do this SPC? No. How long is he here for? So, uh, he is here for, um, 26 days. I love that. He's about 270, 290,000 coins on the PlayStation. He's here for 26 days. So we don't, there's no rush to even get him right now. Surely you can grind him pretty easily. I really, really love that. I didn't even, I, that's something I should have looked at at the beginning of the episode. He's still going to give it a three out of five in terms of value. Should be uh, very, very easy to get. Uh, but uh, that's going to do it for the Thomas Muller player moments episode. Here. A very emotional one. He played, he, to be honest with you, he exceeded expectations. Um, and uh, was just, I'm just very happy to have an 89 Thomas Muller card in the game until that team of the season card gets released. That's all I'm going to say. But that's going to do it for the episode, yeah, boys. Hopefully you guys have enjoyed night off from the stream tonight. We're going to get back at it tomorrow. Going to pick up on our 7-1 weekend league run. Smash like if you guys did enjoy it. Let me know what you think about the Thomas Muller player moments card in the comment section below. And uh, hit that subscribe button if you guys are new to the channel, all right? I'll catch you guys for another upload tomorrow. Till next time, my bros. Tschüss. Later. Ade.